Hey guys, Chase with iDev Hockey here. Today we're gonna to be checking out the new Warrior Alpha QX4 hockey stick. So we have all new shaft dimensions. Warrior calls it their ergo shape. These are rounded corners, double concave sidewalls. It allows you to get a good grip, but really lets you roll a wrist for dangling out there. Uh, for construction materials, we see the True One Phantom construction, an updated process from what we've seen in the past. Gonna give you more consistency, a little bit more responsiveness. We're gonna see upgrading the materials because they're gonna be using a minimus 400 carbon fiber, and then they are gonna combine it with some fiberglass. Both of these gonna combine to give you a surprising amount of responsiveness at this price point. And then that fiberglass gives you a lot of durability, a lot of impact resistance too. For the kick point, we're gonna see a new kick point for Warrior this year. This is what they call their Saber Taper, which delivers a low kick point. Now compared to the QRL series, that covert line, it is gonna be a little bit beefier as far as the taper goes with the Saber Taper. This gives you a little bit more rigidity, uh, torsional stability in the bottom third of the shaft here. So it does push the kick point up a little bit. So if you're looking for a little bit more power than what you tried in the covert line, this can be perfect for you. Still allows you to get a lot of shot power too. And then it is gonna give you some deadly accuracy since it does keep everything nice and in line down towards the bottom. Into the blade, we're still gonna see the soft core X foam package with the single stringer that runs heel to toe giving you good stability for the blade. So stick handling, giving you that good putt control out there. And the soft core X foam is gonna be a little bit more lively. So it's gonna give you some nice pop on those shots, uh, a lot of responsiveness so you know where that puck's sitting at. But you're gonna see upgrade here with their 12K carbon fiber. This is 10% stronger than 3K, which you typically find at this price point. Uh, but the other thing I like about it is that it's lightweight. So it removes weight from the bottom of the shaft, pushes your uh, balance point up, gives you a nice balance feel in the hands. So this is gonna weigh right around 475 grams, a nice 25 gram difference than what we see in the QX5. And that has to do a lot with that 12K carbon in the blade, as well as the minimus carbon in the shaft. I love that kick point on this. So kind of a nice balance between the quick release of a low kick and a little bit of that shot power that you find in the mid kick, um, but still getting that great construction process and some great materials too. But if you're looking for more information, click the shop now button, Give us a thumbs up on the video and make sure you're subscribed to the number one hockey gear review channel on YouTube. See you guys next time.